Hey, it's good to see you. We are back in Walmart and we are going to be doing some shopping for grades three through five. I have my lists here for grades three through five. Now, I do want to point out, first of all, this is Walmart and uh, so it's laid out a little differently. Um, sometimes it tends to be a little noisier in here than it was in the Target the other day. Can't really do anything about that. Um, if I miss anything on these lists, please do keep in mind that I am holding a phone, shopping one-handed, managing three lists with totally different items on each list, pushing a cart one-handed, and navigating the store with customers in it. So sometimes I might overlook something because I'll be honest with you, after a while, everything on these lists starts to look the same. It's very easy to overlook things. So if I do, um, you don't have to tell me, it's okay. We're donating these to a local elementary school to go into their supply closet. So these lists are not for individual children. So if I miss a blue folder, um, the sun will rise again. It's gonna be okay because all of this is gonna be donated to a school. Now, um, let's get started. Nothing fell behind me this time, so that was kind of neat. Um, yeah, it's already starting to get kind of kind of messy over here, but that's okay. All right, so three, four, five. Oh, also, somebody said, why don't you use a clipboard when you do this? Because I, I know it sounds like it would help, but it doesn't because I have to shuffle through these papers dozens of times. I could lay them on a clipboard, I suppose, but then I would also have to not only carry this one handed, but carry the clipboard as well. And it really doesn't help a whole lot, so that's why I don't use a clipboard. Okay, I will stop talking. Well, I'm not gonna stop talking, but I will I will get I will get to work now. <laughs> Alrighty, here we go. We are on the notebook aisle. We we could um we could go ahead and start with notebooks. There's one that's already given up. Let's see. We have on here for the third grade supply list that we need four notebooks. And see I need to be able to spread my papers out. I can't really do that. Even with a clipboard, I can't. Let's see. For the fourth grade school supply list, we need composition notebooks. I'm looking to see if we need other notebooks. We need um, earbuds. Huh. i have to find some earbuds somewhere. I don't, I don't know that we have any over here. Fifth grade composition books. Um, okay, so it looks like nobody needs folders except for third, third grade. They need four notebooks. They don't specify color or anything. They're, I guess they're getting away from that. I know when my kids were in elementary school, they had to have, like, you need a yellow notebook, a blue notebook, a green notebook. I guess they're kind of getting away from that. Here we have pen plus gear. Uh, they don't say how many subjects the notebook has to have. This is a one subject notebook. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get wide ruled because these are elementary school kids. And we will get different colors. One, two, three. I'm gonna get those on the floor in a second. Let me make sure these are all wide ruled. So these are all one subject. We have a purple, a blue, red. That's wide ruled and yellow, that's wide ruled. Okay. Now I do have my pen. Oh, I also have to keep up with a pen. It's in my opposite back pocket. And I have to mark off everything left-handed because I prefer to hold the phone with my right. That's just how I do it. Um. We're going to need to travel to get the composition books. How many do we need? Okay. I'm going to go ahead and get those now while I'm thinking about it. I don't think we needed any for third, third grade, did we? Well, you know what? If we do, I'll go get them in a minute. Four composition books for fourth grade. So we need seven total. Three for fifth grade. Okay. Okay, we're over by the front door and they have all of their composition books here. Now let's see. Uh, 
out. So we need seven total. So you have wide ruled ones, and these are college rule. And again, these are elementary school kids. So let's let's just get wide ruled. Um, and you can tell whether it's wide ruled or college ruled by looking right on the front. One, two. Let's slide that stuff back. Three, four, five, six, seven. Wide ruled. Wide ruled. Okay. Let's get back over here and then I'll check those off. What else do we have over here? We have binders. We have filler paper. Big packs of construction paper. Wow. 240 sheets. We didn't need a nap mat. Look at the size of this whiteboard. Wow. 35 inches by 47 inches. It's 34.88. That thing is huge. We don't need one of those. So I'll come back over to the school supplies section. It's over here. Here's more filler paper. All right. Let me get my pen. We need to write down. I'm gonna check off our composition books. So we got that. Who didn't need, okay. Four, four for this one, three for that one. So that's a total of seven composition books. Do we need filler paper? I'm right here at it. Um, I'm seeing lots of other stuff. Filler paper. Some years, it's weird. Some years they ask for loose leaf paper. Some years they don't. Um, Expo board cleaner. That's a new one. I don't know that we've had to get that one before. And again, while I'm looking at these over and over, after a while, everything on here starts to look the same. I do know we need a bag of candy for every grade, so we're going to need three bags of individually wrapped candy. That'll probably be the last thing we do. Let's go ahead and knock out the folders. Let's come over here. Oh, there's more composition books. That's okay. We got it. I like to just get the black and white ones. Okay, I think I may be wrong, but I think the are the folders down here. No, they're not. On the left of me is composition or sorry, spiral notebooks. Yeah, Target definitely had a larger backpack selection, although they do have backpacks in another part of the store. Where are the Folders. How am I missing folders? Let's see. Are they down here? Now the music right down here is kind of loud. No, these are, these aren't folders. These are binders. Where did the folders go? Somehow I've overlooked the folders. I don't know how I managed to do that. Uh, these are three ring binders. Oh gosh, they're right here. Yeah, the one aisle I went right past. So look, I, oh, isn't that satisfying? Look how organized and pretty they are. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it will not look like this in, in a very short period of time. It will not be like that. Okay, for fifth grade, I need four folders. Uh, and they don't specify, they don't say how, what color or what type. Four folders for fourth grade. Four, eight, twelve. So I need four folders for third grade. So I need a total of twelve. So now what you have to deal with is the uh, the idea of what color folders, what types of folders. Now you do have the ones with prongs, like these right here, and then you have um, you have some that don't have prongs. Like these don't have, no, do they? Some of these don't have prongs. These don't have prongs. Let's go ahead and do the plastic folders with prongs. Okay, so I need uh, 12. What different colors do we have? We have green. These are paper. I don't want to do paper. They fall apart. We have green, blue, and others. Um... 
Paper. Paper. Those are paper. These up here are, well, we have some green plastic. We have orange plastic. Um, let's do... Let's do three of these. One, two, got that little stray one right there. Here's three orange ones. And I'm going to go ahead and get all plastic prong folders, and they all have pockets, so that's good. Do three blue ones. Three, six. Uh... These don't have prongs. Three, six. We'll do three of the green. If I can get them out, let's see. I'm gonna have to pull this out to get these out. Huh, or I could have just grabbed those. <laughs> Whatever. Okay, seven, eight, nine. Seven, eight, nine. Here, all right, I need three more. Don't we have, these are paper. I thought I could find like, I don't want the five star. I was just getting pen plus gear. Um, those are paper, plastic, plastic. I think Target had more choices. Oh, we can get these black ones right here. I'll get three of these. One, two, oops, one, two, three. One, two, three, six, nine, twelve. Okay. So that way we have a little bit of variety in the colors and they're all, they're all the same type. I'm going to make a little table. I'll fix it back in a second. Okay, folders. Four pocket folders for this one. Four folders for that one. Four folders for that one. Now my eye has drifted to pencil pouches. Okay, for here they're saying pencil pouch, no boxes for fifth grade. So a pencil pouch for them, a pencil pouch for fourth grade. Two pouches. And I know I may be looking right at it. These these things really it's weird. I don't know how to describe it, but if you do this very quickly, all of this starts to look alike. <laughs> Two pencil pouches. I'm gonna leave that right there. It's okay. Nobody is gonna mess with that. There's not even anybody over here. All that there is a random cart of groceries that's been sitting here since I got here. Maybe it's stuff that they've picked up to put away that it kind of looks like it because there's a whole, oh God, there's cheese in there. Oh, that's unsettling. All right. Two pencil pouches. No, one of them specifically said no boxes. So let's, I like these with the grommets so you can put them in a, you can put them in a binder if you want to. Let's do, let's do these two pencil pouches right here. These are good. These are the ones my kids have used. They've used these for years. And they're they're actually very durable. And they have the clear pocket on the front so you can see what's in it. Pencil pouches. I'm going to fix this back in a second. Who needed pencil pouches? I don't know. I think third grade didn't need one. One pencil pouch or four pencil pouch for four. Okay. Does anybody need wipes? Clorox wipes. Look what I have. I have Clorox wipes. <laughs> Those are eleven dollars. Ten ninety eight they've gone up since last year. I think they were only nine dollars, eight or nine dollars last year. Three packs of Clorox wipes. What's a pack of three? I'm gonna get them some more. 
Clorox wipes. Now all of these supplies are going into the supply cabinet at the school for anyone to use. I already checked that one off, didn't I? Yes, I did. Do you need, do they need the Clorox wipes? They do. Two containers of Clorox wipes. Two. I'm getting Lysol. <laughs> For me, I don't like the Clorox wipes, and there might be at least one other person who doesn't like them. I don't, uh, I don't like them. They stink. Okay, to me they do. Okay, and again, we're going to need paper towels, Ziploc bags, things like that. Oh, wait a minute. Here is a pencil pouch. I heard you screaming at me. It's right there. We need a zippered pencil pouch or a, or a pencil box. Let me go grab another one. Okay, let's do this fun, let's do this fun light blue one. I like this one. This one has little pockets and stuff. We'll do a light blue one for the third one. This one's pretty. Okay. All right. We need a set of headphones. I don't think I've seen any headphones over here, but it could be that I overlooked them. Okay, we're starting to run into stuff that we're going to find over in the center section. They have a recess equipment on here. I'm not sure what they mean by that. I'm not going to worry about that or the board and card games. I'm not going to worry about those. I'm just sticking to the like this kind of stuff. Now we're going to go to the center section where they have all the random stuff in the little bins. We have cardboard bins. Oh, look at this control, the little controller. Look at this little controller pencil box. Isn't that cute? I just spotted that. That's adorable. Okay. So we're going to come to the center section and see what we can find over here. Um, I'm going to try to... I'm going to just... Uh, I don't know if my cart's going to be in the way. No, I think it'll be all right. What do we want to start with? We can start with glue sticks. How many glue sticks? We need two for fourth grade. Uh, none for fifth. Three for third grade. So we need a pack of two. We need two and three. Two and three. We have the big ones. And then we have six packs of glue sticks. Hey, there's an Aquafina bottle. We saw it the other day. It's still over here. And if you want to be saved, we have some tracks. A whole bunch of tracks under the uh, water bottle. Okay. We have these water, bleh, water bottles. Glue sticks here. You could get the big ones. Let's just do two packs of the six glue sticks to cover. Well, that will just give them each one of those. Okay, let's see. Let's see here. Glue sticks. Three glue sticks for third grade. Um. Glue sticks. There. Okay. Expo markers. Expo markers. Who needs expo markers? Uh, we need ear. We also need earbuds or headphones for fifth grade. Expo. We need a pack of black dry erase markers for third grade. And a pack for fifth grade and two packs of expo black markers for fourth grade so we need four four packs of expo markers four packs they don't specify the size I mean I guess they don't care these packs are massive 
Let's see what we have over here. Do we have... These are just... Uh, oh, here we go. Let's do... Okay, so we need one of these. Let's get a pack of the solid black and we'll get two of the multicolored packs. And yeah, they go through a lot of expo markers, teachers do in the course of a year. So I, I have no problem. I have no problem with that. Now let's see. Get my. Oh, they really do all start to look alike. Erasers, scissors. I've had a lot of helpful hints as far as a way to make this process easier, but really, there's there's not really a way to do it. You just kind of have to, you just kind of, you know, I've done this for several years now, and you just kind of find what works for you. Scissors, two packs. Oh, wait a minute. They needed two packs of black Expo markers. Well, I didn't, I screwed up. I didn't do that. I did one pack of black and one pack of multicolored. Let me... If I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it right. I'm going to take this back and swap it out. And again, if I make mistakes while I do this, if I pick up the wrong thing, I swear to God I am not doing it on purpose. This is harder than it looks. It really... <laughs> this can be difficult. If I had two hands and wasn't making a video, it might be different. All right, pencils, pencils. We need two boxes of 24 pencils, no mechanical, for fifth grade. Uh, colored pencils, scissors, erasers. Two packs of pencils for third grade. So that's four. Uh, Erasers, scissors, colored pencils, crayons, five packs of pencils. Gosh, we need seven packs, seven packs of pencils. I'm coming back. We have pencils right here. Seven packs, you say. Holy smokes, okay. Whew, seven packs. Well, these are $10. So that's seventy dollars. Do we have any smaller? <laughs> I think we do have smaller packs. Come with me. I'm going to show you. Let me uh, grab my stuff. Come with me, darling. We're going to go look at pencils. You would think they had, they would have more pencils in the center section, but they really they really don't. Okay. We do have pencils over here somewhere. Let's see. They are. Where are the? Are they over here? Let's find the pencils right quick. We have. Whoops. These are crayons. Uh, scissors. Okay. We have these 24 packs of Ticonderoga. With three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Are they pre-sharpened? Oh shoot, they're not. I thought these were sharpened. Well, you know what? They have pencil sharpeners. <laughs> I thought these were sharpened. They're actually not. The rest of these are. Maybe I should go with these. These are already sharpened. Hold on, let me, I want to swap them out for these because these are already sharpened and, and one of the lists does say it needs, they need to be sharpened. All right, Walmart, Walmart radio is playing and the DJs, no offense, are obnoxious as hell and they keep talking. So I apologize if you hear them, sorry. Oh, these are like darker, look, that must be a different kind of wood or something. Okay, these are Stetler Premium Pencils. One, two, three, four, five. And see, these are sharpened. Six, seven. Okay. All right. Well, we can go back where we were because we still need things over there.
They didn't ask for backpacks or anything, so I'm not going to worry about that. But we do need to get... We probably need erasers and stuff. Alright, let's see. I need to... Gonna need to mark off my pencils, huh? Do need to do that. Let's see. Two packs of number two pencils. Got that. Pencils. And <laughs> five. I thought they said they had to be sharpened. I'm probably thinking about one of the lists from the other video. Which, I'm not sure when you're going to see this, but I, rec I made that video just yesterday, so... I have school supplies coming out of my ears right now. Let's see. Index card. Expo board cleaner. We may have to go to the office supplies section. Hold on a second. We could just get this right here. This has board cleaner in it, and it also has an eraser and some extra markers. Let's get them. Let's just get them that whole. We'll get them that whole thing, and it has board cleaner in it. Let's see. Yeah. Okay. Let's see here. We need two pink erasers. This list looks so simple. It's just like bloop. <laughs> pink erasers. They're also asking for bottles of water. I'm not, I'm not going to take a bunch of bottles of water to school. I'm just, I'm worried about this right here. Uh, two pink erasers. One pack of erasers. So I guess we just need three, three packs of erasers. Okay. Hey, there's Jurassic Park. Look at that. Two mo oh, sorry, five movie collection. That's pretty cool. I don't think that goes there. <laughs> Let me see. Highlighters. I don't think anybody needed highlighters. I did need a pack of post-it notes. Somebody needed post-it notes. Let's see. Didn't I just see erasers? I probably did. Let's see. Nobody needed mechanical pencils. There are some erasers. I wanted the little pink erasers. These are erasers. I don't want those though. I wanted the, where are the little pink ones? Dang it. We have eraser caps. I don't think anybody needed those, though. A lot of these are empty. A lot of these are empty. So, we do have our post-it notes. Do have our post-its. Who needed post-its? I don't remember. I saw post-its on here. Right here. Index cards. Mm. Oh, look at this. I didn't see these. Look at all these Sharpies. This is 1047. Oh, I want this. I want this for myself. This is cool. I'm getting this for myself. <laughs> I have a massive Sharpie collection. Okay. I'm getting these for me. I, look, these are neat. Look at all the colors. I want that. Okay. I haven't found the erasers. It's it's fine right there. I promise you it's okay. We're going to come over here. See what we can find. If I were erasers, where would I be? Okay, here we have pens. Oh, that reminds me, pens. My older son asked me to pick up some pens. He said he didn't care. He likes the retractable kind. I'll get him these. I'm going to get him a pack of these. 
Wow, that's a big pack. I'll just get him these. These are fine. We have highlighters. Oh, look at that eraser. These are cool. It's a jumbo eraser. These are only 22 cents. Let's grab a couple of these. Here we have more erasers. That's a five pack. Um, I really wanted some of the pink pearl. Oh God, they're right in front of me. There they are. We'll grab some of these. And these, I like the little rainbow erasers. Those are cool. I'm gonna get one more. <laughs> those, those are neat, I didn't see those before. Okay, and I remembered my son's pens. He said he knows he's gonna need some pens for school. They, like I, well, I mentioned in the Target video, they don't have their school supply list yet. They typically come home with them on the first day of school. So, yeah, I won't get to do their shopping until all of this is picked over. <laughs> it's very stressful and it irritates the daylights out of me, but that's the way it goes. Okay. Erasers. This erasers here. Two pink erasers. Oh, we did need a package of cap erasers. It's right there. Well, we know where those are. I know where those are. Let's go grab them. The cap erasers are right down here. Right here. Pentel high polymer eraser caps, non abrasive. Cool. Crayons. We haven't done crayons yet. We need one pack of crayons for fourth grade, one for third. Um, I know the big kids don't get any fifth graders, just two boxes of crayons. Where are the crayons? Hmm. Well, I know where they are. I was just looking to see if we have any over here. Those are markers. We have markers, washable markers, regular markers. Oh, there's the erasers right there. I just didn't come down far enough. That's okay. Colored pencils. Those are washable crayons. Um, they don't have the Crayola over here. That's okay, I know where they are. Again, it's, it's okay. It's okay, we're coming over here. Our cart's a big kid now, we can trust it. The music is loud over here. Sometimes I have to be careful about copyright. Okay, the music is very loud over there. I just had to go grab them. Got our crayons. I have to, with the music, I have to worry about copyright issues, so I have to try to keep the music out of the video. One box of crayons. That's another thing I have to be mindful of while I do this, is the music. In Target, there really isn't any music, so you don't have to worry about it, but in here you do. Paper towels, tissue. We have paper products, candy. Colored pencils. We need one pack of colored pencils here. They don't specify. They just say colored pencils for fifth grade. So we'll just do a pack for them. One, two, and we need three total because we need one for third grade as well. And they don't specify the size, but I think typically they just want the 12, the 12 count packs of colored pencils. Um, of course you have the Crazy Art colored pencils which I don't like. 24, here we go. Down here, the 12 packs of Crayola colored pencils. These are perfect. Get the 12 packs of Crayola colored pencils. Mark that off. One pack of colored pencils here. One pack of colored pencils here. And right here. All right, we need scissors. A pair of scissors for fifth grade. We need a pair for fourth grade. And 
We need a pair for third grade, so we need three pairs of scissors. Three pairs of scissors. Look at all the glue sticks. Those are big scissors. I don't want those. Um, the scissors are in the loud music section. I'm trying to avoid going back over there because it's, it's, you have to worry about it. Um, and sometimes I get distracted by moving out of the way and I overlook things. Now, well, I'm going to have to go back over here for my scissors. The music is quiet at the moment. Nobody's singing. I don't, well, I don't think they are. They're probably working up to it. Scissors. Oh, there's the music. Stupid horse with no name. Give the horse a name and shut up. Let's see. The erasers. Oh, scissors right here. I need three pairs of scissors. Now, these are the older kids. Three, third, fourth, and fifth grade. So, I don't know if they want the little, the little blunt tip ones or if they want... These are for ages four plus. Four plus. What about these? Well, these are four plus as well. What should I do? I don't know. Ooh, this ruler is cool. Look at that. That's pretty. Sorry, that's not. They never ask for rulers. I could just get like a multi pack of scissors. How much are these? Six pack. These are only $7.97. It's cheaper than... Look, I can get six pairs of scissors cheaper than getting them individually. We have those. Hmm. Should I just get a pack? Well, I don't know. Let's see. What are these? Why are these different? I'll just get the six pack. I don't know. Okay, they have, wait a minute, they have those up there. What are those? Are these for bigger kids? Oh, no, these are ages 12 and up. Never mind. They don't need these. We'll just go ahead and we'll just get them a whole pack of six. And that way they'll have, they'll have some extra ones to go with it. Very nice. Okay. So they're not individually packaged, but again, this is for the supply closet. It's not for an individual kid. All right. Uh, scissors. We got everybody's. We got everybody's scissors and then some. Oh, we need index cards. Scissors. We're starting to run into the random things. Nobody needed highlighters or filler paper. Okay. Well, let's go find index cards. I do find, though, and I mentioned this the other day, I do find that for my kids, as they've gotten older, their school supply lists have gotten a lot smaller. There's nowhere near as much on the list as it used to be. Do we have index cards down here? I do have index cards down here. Who needed index cards? Let's see. One pack of index cards for fourth grade. And that's it. I just need one. Okay, these are ruled. These are ruled index cards. I'm going to mark that off. We need to mark off index cards. All right, now we need paper products, hand sanitizer, earbuds, candy. Okay, we got to move on from here. Well, I did find the headphones. We need either earbuds or headphones from home and a set of headphones here. So let's just grab... We're going to get these two sets of headphones here, and I can mark that off, so we've taken care of that. There. I don't think fourth grade needed any. Okay. Okay, actually, I was wrong. I do need a set of earbuds. I missed it. Where'd it go? 
Oh yeah, right here, one set of earbuds. So I found these back here. I found these back here in the electronics section. Okay, I'm gonna mark this off. So that takes care of that. Now let's go to the paper products. I found cardstock. We were looking for this at Target the other day. It's seven dollars. Jesus. Okay, we'll go ahead and get the cardstock too. So I said that, but that was from that was from the other list. But it's all it's all going to the same place, so it's totally fine. Actually, first I was coming through here and I noticed that I need Ziploc bags, and they are right here. So I need one gallon size. I need one gallon size and one quart size. Here's gallon, quart. So I need, and this is it. I, that's all I needed for Ziploc bags. And those are both for the third grade. The other two didn't need any Ziploc bags. Okay, it's very noisy back here. Everybody's, they're, they're putting out a bunch of stock and it, it can be, it can get a little bit noisy back here. So let's see. We need tissues, I bet, and those are right here. I need two boxes here. It looks like I need a total of, here they just have tissues, they don't specify. Two here and four here. Let's just get, let's get two packs of four. We'll get two packs of four. I think that should cover everybody. Two boxes of tissues there. And then they just say tissues. And then they say four here. Paper towels, we need two rolls here. They don't specify here, it just says paper towels. Uh, one here. Let's do four, let's do four rolls of paper towels. Do we have a four pack of paper towels? Um, good golly, look at all the paper towels. It's crazy. Well, we have these two packs, three packs, two packs, six packs, 12 packs. Dang, here, let's do, oh, I can't reach that. Ugh. Here we go. We'll do, we'll do these two. <laughs> All right, look, balls. You can get, you can put sheep's balls in your dryer and make your clothes fluffy. We don't need sheep balls today. We just need school supplies. Here we go. Paper towels. Gonna, well, they didn't go in there like I wanted them to. Make them look nice. There we go. Paper towels. That covers, that should be paper towels for everybody. One roll here. No specified amount here. We need bags of candy too. Then we have, oh, hand sanitizer. We still need that. I need three bags of candy. So actually, <laughs> now we get to go look at candy, which is, that is always fine with me. Look at all the lunch meat. Look at all the empty spots. Yes, okay, candy. Now when you wanna get candy for school, I like to find the peanut free candy if possible. Having a kid with a peanut allergy, you get used to that. I wanna find candy that's individually wrapped. Oh, I near about missed it. Hey, we organized this gum at one point. Look at it, it's trashed again. Yes, we need to organize this candy aisle. You can get bags like this. I'm not looking to get big bags like that. I want to get smaller bags of candy. They recommended, one of their recommendations was blow pops. This section is nasty. Look at, 
Oh my God, ooh. We need to organize the candy aisle. And I do wanna do that one day. I wanna come in here and organize the candy. Hold on a second, I'm getting into chocolate. I'm not looking, I'm not looking for chocolate. Let's see. Twizzlers. Somebody busted a lid on a can of Skippy. Um, let's see. Gosh, we don't actually have choices like I expected to see. These are, that's sugar-free. Here we go. Tootsie Pops. Let's do, oh, right here. Let's do a bag of, let's see. We'll do some Tootsie Pops right here and some Dum Dums. We have limited edition Dum Dums in the original mix. And here we, oh, ooh, tropical mix. Let's grab these three. This right here. So that's three bags of individually wrapped candy. I think Dum Dums are peanut free. All right, that's our candy, individually wrapped candy, i.e. blow pops. And I'm not going to worry about giving money for water bottles. Okay, hand sanitizer. We don't need fifth grade is not worried about sanit sanitization. <laughs> we need two bottles for third grade, two bottles for fourth. So we need four bottles of hand sanitizer. Okay, well, we're not gonna find hand sanitizer over here. You wanna walk with me through Walmart? Some more? <laughs> yeah, see, you know what I wanna do one day? I wanna come in here and organize all that. It would take, oh my God, if I had to estimate how long it would take to do all of this, I would say two and a half to three hours to do it. But then you also have interruptions. You're gonna have, you're gonna have to stop. You're gonna have to get out of the way of people. You know what I mean? Oh, minimum three hours or two and a half, minimum two and a half. These are big, but yeah, I would say at least, at least two and a half hours to do all this. Because too, you have to remember I'm doing it one handed while I, I'm, this is it. This one hand would have to do the whole, the whole thing. Yeah, it would take a while. It would definitely take a while. Okay. Over here in the center aisle, you have, ooh, look at the chips. We have flaming Hot Nachos. flaming Hot Nacho Doritos. Doritos 3D Crunchy Spicy Ranch. Cool Ranch. They have the vintage design on the Doritos right now. <laughs> yes, we have cereal. We have pajamas. Cute little pajamas and little, little things that you can wear. Look at that big old box of Pop-Tarts. 10.73, you can get 42 Pop-Tarts. Wow. We have Cheerios. We have Strawberry Banana and Honey Vanilla Cheerios. Since the Honey Vanilla is new, they got their bathing suits on clearance. You could get, you could get a Happy Cake. You could get a Louisiana Crunch Cake, a Socket to me. A socket to me cake. Cinnamon swirl cake made with real Saigon cinnamon topped with pecans and a sweet glaze. Yeah. They're already starting to put out their winter their winter stuff. Look at this. Gosh, that thing is long. That big old long. Oh. That's big. That's $34.98. We have some little dresses here. Big old quilted coat. This is $44.98 for the coat. I'm not crazy about the color. Oh, this is pretty. Look at this. It's like a little pea coat. This is $44.98. Oh, I like this one. Isn't that pretty? It's 
sorry. You can also get cookies. You can get a big old thing of cookies. Yeah, I'm not here for cookies. Okay. We have more coats. Those are cute. I like the navy blue. That's pretty. Oh my gosh. Yes. We're getting rid of shorts because summer is, the, you can see the end of summer is coming soon. We have more clothes down here. The floor is very shiny. Look at the floor. We have a little, here we have some candy too, right in the middle here. Okay. All right, so we're going to find hand sanitizer. I kind of thought they'd have some with school supplies, but they didn't. I was looking at this the other day, this little sports bra. Isn't this cute? I like that. That's that's really cool. I like that. And these are really comfortable. I have several of these, like just solid, like have some solid black and they have burgundy. This one's cool though. I like that. I like that design. Okay, sorry. Let's uh <laughs> let's keep let's keep going. So, it, yeah, I do have to worry about music in here and copyright stuff, so sometimes I just keep talking to try to drown out the music and I'm just trying to not let it. <laughs> I'm trying to scramble the music a little bit by talking over it. So you come down here and you get into housewares, uh, home decor. I'm not exactly sure why. Oh, I think I know. I think the hand sanitizer is down here where the lotion is. I think. And I'm kind of, I'm kind of irritated with Aveeno right now. They did away with, they did away with the lotion. I like. They don't have it anymore. They made this non-greasy lotion. Well, a lot of their lotions aren't greasy, but they had this one that was really cool. And I don't think they make it anymore. I'm kind of bummed out. I can't find it anywhere. We have swabs and swispers. Swispers. <laughs> Sorry, I think hand sanitizer is down here somewhere. We have shampoo and stuff. All right, let's see. Hair stuff. Oh, I see it back there. It's on the back wall. We have all of our liquid hand soap over here. We have a, wow, Olay has a hand soap, look at that, Dove, oh dear, that's a tragedy, that's a tragedy, I'm not touching it, okay, what did I say, how many of these did we need, we need two for third grade, fifth grade we're done, I think we're done with fifth grade, two for four so we just need four bottles of hand sanitizer and then we have completed our list let's see hmm they have too many choices they have too many choices one two i'm going to grab these two at a time so we have two here one two Three, four. Okay. Here we have it. Two there. Two there. Oh my gosh. I think we have completed our task. Yes. All right. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoy getting to shop for this stuff today. We did third grade, fourth grade, and fifth grade, and we got all of our stuff. Very nice, very nice. I think that went really well. Now we go pay for all this. Thank you so much for being here. I really hope that you enjoyed our little shopping trip today, and I hope you have a wonderful day. I'll see you again soon.